So guys, let's go through the ingredients that we need for today's recipe. Firstly, I've got one and a half cup of split chickpeas that I've soaked overnight, washed thoroughly and drained. Then I've got half a cup of cooking oil. Now you can use vegetable oil, you can use olive oil, you can use sunflower oil, whichever you prefer. Then I've got one medium sized red onion which I've thinly sliced. I've got one tablespoon of garlic ginger paste, five to six green chilies, six to seven cloves of garlic and some chopped coriander. And I've got two medium sized tomatoes that I've chopped into cubes. And for the spices, I've got one tablespoon of cumin, five to six cardamom, two medium sized bay leaves, a stick of cinnamon, and a spice mix which I've prepared. Now the spice mix contains one tablespoon of red chili powder, three fourths of a tablespoon of turmeric powder, half a tablespoon of cumin powder, three fourths tablespoons of coriander powder, and one fourth of a tablespoon of garam masala powder. And finally, I've got salt which you can add in according to your own preference. So let's start. So guys, the first thing we're gonna do is heat up three fourths of the cup of cooking oil in a large pot. And then we're gonna add in the chopped onions. Also, we're gonna add in the stick of cinnamon, the cumin seeds, the cardamom, and the bay leaves into it. Then we're gonna get a spatula and start to mix this together. and let the onions fry until it turns golden brown. And at this stage, you can add in your chopped tomatoes. And then add in your green chilies. And your spice mix. And then make sure to mix all of this entirely together nicely. Then you can put in your chickpeas into the mix. And you can add in your garlic ginger paste. And finally, I'm gonna add in two tablespoons of salt. And then I'm gonna mix all of this together nicely.
and then I'll add in around two to two and a half cups of water and put the lid on and leave it on a medium to high heat for around 25 minutes. So guys, the lentils have been done and I've kept that to the side after 30 minutes. So guys, the lentils have been done. I've kept that to the side after 45 minutes and I've taken a little saucepan and added in the remainder of the cooking oil and I'm letting it to heat up slowly. And as it's hot, I'm gonna add in the garlic cloves which I've chopped thinly into the oil. And I'm slowly gonna start to fry that until it starts turning brown. Adding the garlic that I've fried onto the lentils and put a lid on on a low heat for another two minutes and then it's finally done. And there you go guys, my split chickpea recipe.